welcome to social with sneha today we are going to discuss a new topic about longitudes so what are the longitudes you can observe on the board a circle is drawn and the lines are drawn those are the longitudes yes because the longitudes are the imaginary lines which are drawn over the globe vertically it means from top to bottom the word longitudes are derived from the latin word longitudo okay so that on words it was called as a longitude and coming to the longitudes very clearly we can observe here on the globe suppose you think that this is a globe spherical shape the red color mark here we can see this is the 0 degree longitude 0 degree longitude which is most important and this is called as a prime meridian 0 degree longitude is called as what prime meridian and this 0 degree longitude which specifies means which gives us the information that the globe is divided into western hemisphere and eastern hemisphere so here the hemisphere means the entire globe is divided into two equal halves so what specifies us 0 degree longitude which we are calling as a prime meridian it is specifying the earth into western part and eastern part already we discussed in the last class about latitude what specifies the globe into northern part and southern part that is equator 0 degree latitude in the same manner 0 degree longitude which specifies the globe into western part and the eastern part now coming to the number so here when we observe the globe clearly you can see here the markings 15 degrees 30 degrees 45 degrees means 15 degrees every 15 degrees is considered like that you can see 180 towards the east and 180 towards the west okay so what you can observe here we can observe very clearly that 180 longitudes are towards the eastern and 180 longitudes are towards the western hemisphere so combination means the entire globe consists of how many longitudes the entire globe consists of 360 longitudes okay so i think this clear ma so how many longitudes we are having total 360 longitudes we are having and coming to the eastern hemisphere 180 longitudes western hemisphere another 180 longitudes 60 longitudes and the 180 towards the east and 180 towards the west so coming to the each and every longitude from one longitude to the another longitude there is a gap of 15 degrees means see here 0 then 15 degrees 30 45 60 means each from one longitude to the another zone this is a zone means for every line from one line to the another line there is a gap which is filled with the 15 degrees means 15 longitudes so mostly when we move from the 0 degree towards the east we will add we will add the time and when we move from the 0 degree towards the west we will subtract means we will minus deduct why what is the reason why we have to add towards the east and why we have to deduct towards the west because it is based on the direction of a rotation means when the earth moves suppose you think that this is a globe so when the earth sun is a static body it will not move but earth moves so the direction when the earth is moving it is starting from the west to east from west to east that is why so it moves like this from the west towards the east suppose now here it has started and it has moved so if we take 12 here in the 0 degree what happens when it is moving towards the east when it is moving towards the east what happen 12 then 1 2 3 4 means it will add but already from here the earth has started from here it has moved towards the east means already the action has started and it is completed then what we have to take the time we have to suppose here it is 12 then 11 10 
9 already completed. So if we add up, it becomes wrong. Already completed action. It has started from here and it is going there. Then we have to deduct from the west. So when it is moving towards the west, we have to deduct the value. Means we have to deduct by 1 hour. 12, 11, 10, 9, so on. That is why when we move from the 0 degree towards the east, we have to add. And when we move from the 0 degree to the west, we have to deduct. Okay. So, we will discuss about these time zones and this topic very clearly in the next session. And uh, we will meet very shortly with a new topic. I hope that it is very clear to you all. If you like my video, please share, comment and subscribe my channel. We will meet you shortly with the next session related to time zones. Thank you all.